G'day, I'm Robbie Charles, second generation beekeeper. I left school when I was 15 to go and work in the old man's business, mainly because I hated school. <laughs> We used to be a bulk export facility and now we're becoming more of a packaged export. We've expanded quite a bit in the last 10 years due to Nicola and really I'm just a beekeeper. <laughs> That's a good team. So with the increased production in the field, we needed to do more retail packaging, hence the expansion this time. We were fortunate enough to get a small grant and so we decided it was time for us to extend the offices, extend the packing room and also put a cafe interpretation centre on the front so people could see what we do. We also put a cool store and uh, storage facility down on our other block. We've done a number of projects with Bison. Uh, one in particular is our cool store at Black River and that went really well. We chose Bison because they're good project managers. They also uh, have quality sheds as well. When we were researching who to, to build, they really stood out because their quality of their product is much better than anyone that we saw on the market. Very uh, cost effective as well and you do get um, good value for money. There was nothing that was a, a problem to them. No, when they said they was going to do something, they were there on that day to do it and uh, it was completed on time. You know, service was second to none, really. The background of this cupboard essentially was rather than having to go out and get a pack of boxes every time they need them, this works really well because we actually put them, put them here on the shelving and they can actually pick from those from the other side. Um, so it keeps that area clean, we don't have to take forklifts inside, we don't have to take pallet trucks. So Bison helped with how to do it. The internal doors are refrigeration panelling which works great on runners and then we had the external cavity doors. They organised all these windows, they're not glass, they're actually perspex, we had to look at the safety side of it as well. I was quite happy with how they turned out. So another part of the build that we put on is we're actually underneath a, a Bison shed. We can look through into the processing area, so if we're needed for help or we can see quality issues, we can actually easily uh, get onto those pretty quickly. The good thing about being here is that we're all of a team, we're not in separate areas, we can actually see and help each other when that's needed. The uh, refrigeration panelling that's here uh, in the office is really good because what it enables us to do is not use a lot of power to keep the place warm. Just with the help of uh, one heat pump. We thought we'd have to put three in but one is heating this area really well. For future proofing, if we want to uh, turn this area into a processing area, we can. Uh, we've got an area that can be quickly adapted because of how we've built it and how the Bison have actually built it for us. The whole process was stress-free. For us that was very good because we had another area, so the interpretation centre and the cafe, so we just said to the Bison guys, Sort this area out, so it took the load off me as a project manager on site here. Probably build another shed out the back for a workshop, and yeah. so but a anyway, that's the future. Yeah, a few more projects in the years to come, and we'll look to use Bison, so we can't fault them. Mm -hmm.